Thomas, we just heard uh, Liam Cooper uh, speaking about the need to sacrifice in order to succeed uh, the hard work that they've got to put in. Do you maybe need to sacrifice your footballing style in the next few weeks? Well, what we need to sacrifice is on the pitch, everyone giving more than we have uh, in all the situations. Me, of course, in preparing the, the game, trying to choose the best eleven for this uh, special game. And the players on the pitch, they have to see it as a, a final, uh, a game where we have to change this negative uh, performances. Do you feel the players maybe have just dropped off a little bit in the last few weeks? Or? What they drop off was a little bit in, in the confidence. Of course, the results, the positive, give more confidence. And when you lose a game, uh, you lose also your, your confidence. But if we look back to the last three games that we lost, we had the possibilities, two of them at least, to, to, to win them. Against Sheffield Wednesday, we had two very clear opportunities to get 0-2 up in the score and finally we lose against Reading we were better in in general the, in the game in the second half we create more opportunities we deserved more but at the end it was not possible is it an arm round the shoulder week or a kick up the backside week leading into this game excuse me is it have you had to build up the players or have you given them a few harsh words this week well i I think mm, you have to treat them in, in one way and another way. They have to realize the things that we, we need to improve. If we want to, to compete in this level and stay up, we need to, to invest much more in all the actions that, uh, that we do to understand right what we need to do on, on the pitch. And of course, on the other side, I need to, to win back the, the confidence of the of the players, uh, they had to believe in themselves and it's still the same players we have now that were able to be first in, in, in the table, playing very good games, taking good wins, the sixth clean sheet in a row. It haven't changed too much and if we look back to the last three defeats and we take the wins in these two games that I just mentioned, would well, have been in, in a very good position now. It's a big week, obviously, if you're playing two of the teams in the top six with you, you've got the cup game in between. Are you just focused on purely on Saturday and you'll, you'll worry about those two games after? No, no, only on, on the one on Saturday. And team-wise, fitness-wise, how's the squad looking? Perfect, perfect. Only Caleb is it out and the rest is, is available. Ronaldo Vieira, obviously, said last week he hadn't had much training. Do you expect him to play a part this weekend? Well, he's in, in the squad, uh, as I mentioned also last time I got the, the, the question why he was, uh, wasn't playing it, because he came from an injury where he only trained two days. Um, this time he has had uh, the whole week with the, with the team and he's in, in the squad for, for the game tomorrow. And looking at Bristol City, obviously they've had a great start to the season, long unbeaten run, they're unbeaten at home. What are you expecting from them tomorrow? Well, from what I have seen, uh, our analysis is a tough game. Uh, perhaps one of the best teams that we will face until now. Um, so it will not be easy, but at the same time, it's another motivation that they are unbeaten uh, at home, that they only lost one game against Birmingham. So uh, we look forward for, for this game, and if we're able... To, to take a good result, it's also good for, for the confidence. When you're on a run such as this, and it is only three games, is the onus on stopping them playing, or is it how well you play that will dictate what happens tomorrow? Both, both. Of course, when, it's, when you come from, from this situation that we're in right now, we need to be, be effective, we need to do the things clear. You need to work hard, and once you get or re you recover, the confidence, then you can do more things. It's a crazy league, isn't it, the championship? It's amazing. This is what I like, that you can win all the games and you can lose all the games. So there are small details who marks if you take the three points or, or don't.